news from the showrooms and design studios of the automotive world, this is Fastlane Daily. I'm Derek D with your automotive brief. If you're a connoisseur of fine Italian cars, and let's face it, who isn't? Check out the latest from Zagato. Earlier today, the famed styling house revealed its new Coachworks project. It's called the Otovu, and it was created in honor of the Italian car brand Diato's 100th anniversary. Before 1955, Diato built cars for kings and queens, and also for racetracks. Back in the roaring 20s, the two companies collaborated on a few fine machines. Now the curvaceous Otovu will have its coming out party in Geneva next month. Zagato hasn't released details yet. We're pretty sure it'll be powered by a supercharged Maserati V8. No word yet on which Swiss banker signed that check. Earlier this week, a Nissan GTR test vehicle was caught on camera in New Mexico. The new sports coupe is getting a final once over on American soil before launching at the Tokyo Motor Show later in the year. The GTR will be an all new version of the Nissan Skyline. That car has been a favorite with the import tuner crowd for decades. Well, unlike previous Skylines, this GTR will be exported to the US, and that can mean major competition for the Porsche 911. Where it is, the GTR will come with a 3.6 liter twin turbo V6, producing 450 horsepower. So mark your calendars or start making scratch marks on the wall. We'll see the GTR in showrooms sometime spring 2008. Toyota says it's come up with a new instant mapping navigation system. That means no more relying on software updates from the dealer. Toyota says this system will use a wireless internet connection to update the maps every time the system is powered up. And that means it can highlight roadway snafus like construction, volume delays, or the occasional overturned chicken truck. Toyota calls the system Map On Demand. But don't look for it at Best Buy. Toyota's testing the system in Japan before exporting it overseas. Next up, the internet rumor mill, right after this. Got a story for Fastlane Daily? Or even a hot tip? Rumor? A forum flame war? We want to know about it. Give us a call at 213-291-1883 or tips at fastlanedaily.com. What's the latest in loose talk? Do you remember the El Camino? How could you not? Think about it. You know, business in the front, party in the back. Or is it the other way around? Anyway. Rumor has it General Motors may be considering reviving the pickup car for the American market. It's not as crazy as it sounds. In Australia, GM's Holden division never stopped building pickup cars. Down under, they call them utes. Now, Australia's CarPoint says one of those utes can become a GMC product. It's the same strategy GM is using with the new Pontiac G8, the G8 being the same car as the Holden's VE Commodore. Confused yet? <laughs> Imagine how confused this guy is. That wraps up Fastlane Daily for today. Tune in tomorrow when we try to hotwire a police cruiser and make it cross the state line. I'll see you later.